Okay, good evening viewers. Today is going to be pretty much a one take uh, vlog from me. Um, Kim is away and has left the uh, website or the channel in um, my hands. Um, <laughs> I've not exactly um, been doing much to it today. And I promised him that I would get something done to put on. Silence, please! <laughs> I promised him that I would uh, get something done or put something on on the channel so you guys had something to look at um, Been very 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 busy today. This is my last day off before I go back to work And I've had a wedding video to edit which I've been plugging away like mad at trying to get it complete and um, I'm nearly there so close to finishing it now um, This will be my second one my second video wedding video because uh, I did one for Nat and Chris who you have seen in previous videos and that was wicked I won't show you any of it though because um, well unless I get permission from her I'm not gonna put anything up on the uh, on the channel um, so yeah, I've been very busy. I've been doing that. I went shopping today. Oh, I'm now officially a, a Sainsbury's boy. I don't know if there's anything to be proud of about that, but um, yeah, basically, um, it's just so much nicer going around there. It's so much better. I mean, Tesco's is great, but where our store is situated, it's right opposite town, so people avoid paying um, to park in a multi-story car park, and basically, you end up with the Tesco's being jam-packed. Um, full of all people that want to shop in town to avoid paying and that just means you can't get in you know, It's just stressful and I hate I, I absolutely hate fighting for car parking spaces So um, yeah, I've just decided that the, the Sainsbury's which is new and it's just opened up a little bit down the road Which is not opposite town. It's not really walkable. It's a bit dodgy because of like dual carriageway and whatnot It's so much more pleasant in there It's quiet you can park and maybe pay a little bit more. I don't know but the quality is really good, so I've had a nice pork chop and mash dinner this evening. So I thought the camera just died for me. You are running on low battery at the moment, and I would plug you in, but the cable is so short, I'd be literally having you on the floor. You like this? Hi guys. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, this is going to be pretty much a one-take vlog, and that's probably nearly over anyway. Um, this is the wedding video I'm doing here. I'm just using my Adobe Premiere. Um, elements to edit it and these are some of the pictures that are in it um, little fact you some of you probably won't believe me on this but do you remember I don't know maybe about a month or so ago there was a massive internet storm it was all over the news and everything as well that um, uh, there was that video put up on the internet of that cat that was put in the bin now that was massive controversy wasn't it there was a lot going on about that well the people that own that cat I've, are my cousin, and um, yeah, not many people believe that. Um, you probably all go in the comments and say, yeah, whatever now, but the person's who wedding I'm actually editing now is my cousin who owns that cat, basically. They're all over the news and everything, so um, it's kind of like, wow, when you see them all over you know, the TV and the newspapers and everything, and literally two weeks before that happened, I filmed their wedding video. Um, yeah, it's, it's a bit insane really, so that's who I'm doing it for. So, a little bit of exciting stuff there. Uh, we came up with some great um, video ideas. Well, actually, I came up with some great video ideas today. And I'm hoping to do them in the next few days. Um, as I'm back to work, um, I've got possibly some time in which I can do some filming for you. Um, if not, it's going to be literally like a couple of little vlogs like this every now and again put up this week. As I am going to be busy, um, but uh, today will be this video, and then tomorrow is probably going to be the Christmas tree putting up video. Now you saw the, the video previous to this one, which was the uh, Christmas tree overkill, I think it was called, and uh, yeah, you saw the Sonic tree topper and the massive, like, flashy star we put up on, on the tree itself, which is a bit insane. And I thought it was a bit overkill. Lots of decorations, lots of sparkly things, and things that light up and everything. But um, yeah, it was uh, it was pretty. It, was, it looks amazing, <laughs> if not somewhat of an overkill. But um, yeah, we're gonna put the video up of us uh, getting all the bits out of the loft and everything. And I think there was some funny moments in that. So yeah, it should be uh, one worth to watch. But yeah, if you haven't seen the Christmas tree overkill, it's the video previous to this one. So go check it out now. It's only about 36 seconds long, but you'll see what I mean regarding to it being a bit of an overkill. Um, so yeah, that'll probably go up tomorrow because uh, that's down to Kim to edit and put up as it's on his flip. 
um, and not on my Kodak. Um, what else is there to talk about? What else is new? Um, I'm eating my Petit Falou. Oh, I love these things. I'm absolutely addicted to them. One of the things that the guys know about me since living in the house with me is that um, I always have some of these in the fridge and I always eat two at a time. I have a bit of strawberry and a bit of apricot. Snap them off in two like that and I just, I just love them. I'm addicted to Petit Falou. And I've got, oh, got a fridgy milkshake, which I probably have for... Um, breakfast tomorrow oh and these things as well these are absolutely awesome got some of these today from Sainsbury's Copperberg cider um, there's a, a lime and strawberry one which is absolutely gorgeous and uh, this one I've not tried before this is what is this mixed fruit so um, if you haven't tried these and you like cider just try them I know they may seem a bit, a bit of a girl's drink and if you're a guy but they're gorgeous and girls you'll love them too obviously I'm not promoting underage drinking here so don't go and get any or try and, and drink some of this stuff if you're underage because I don't want to be the one you come back to saying you said you had this stuff and, and, and now I got in trouble with the law or my daddy told me off because um, well that's down to you okay guys um, I don't know if you have many um, what was that so many um, underage viewers underage drinking viewers on this channel but um uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, I'm sure there'll be a few out there. Oh, while we're on the uh, talk topic of viewers, um, shout outs for people who have asked for them. Uh, one shout out. God, I'm going to forget some of these now because there's a lot of messages sent in. And um, I do apologize. Oh, I tried to, in I think it was in yesterday's video, which will go up tomorrow. Bit of a mishmash here. Um, I tried to say shout out to Perechuj. Perez Chuj, I don't know how you pronounce that, there's a symbol, and um, yeah, the camera can't focus on things close up, but it's the blue one there, it's like a PTG, I can't, I don't know how to pronounce that one properly, also, uh, Coos4, he wanted a shout out, so there's your shout out buddy, um, I'm going to see if I can find his logo very quickly, it's quite distinguishable, uh, little lad, actually yeah, he will be underage, yeah, yeah, talking about underage drinking and whatnot. He's underage, so um, you can't drink any of that, that cider stuff. But um, it is good. Uh, where is he? But he's quite a good lad, this one. He's, he's always commenting on our, on our profiles. And um, on our profiles, on our videos. Here he is, Coos4. Coos TV is his little um, profile here. Little kid with a cap on. And he does some interesting stuff. I like the words and everything he pops up which relate to his videos. Oh, and who was that new guy who I promised to shout out because he did some awesome stuff for us. Um, his profile picture was a little lad with a cap on. And, um, oh, I'm going to struggle to find him now. Oh, what was his name? Let me check my inbox because I've been messaging him back that's one thing I would like to say guys if you want to send us a message we will respond it may take us some time a little bit because we are getting shit loads of don't swear we are getting a lot of messages in at the minute and um... oh no what's your name what's your name this is terrible I am bad with names it's not just people obviously we're getting a lot of messages but I'm just generally terrible with names you say you introduce me to someone and then a little while later I can't remember their name is this it yes it is this is it okay shout out to R -R Rogers 2009 Z channel this is it this guy gave us some uh, help and advice with that channel earlier on, and it was um, it was well appreciated. It helped us out with a few things we wanted to do. And oh, he's got the Eminem "Love the Way You Lie" and his favourites, which I also do on my channel, on my personal one anyway. So um, yeah, shout out to him. Good channel. I'm not sure who the kid is. I'm sure I'm assuming that whoever made this uh, channel is not the kid, but it's about the kid. And I don't know what his name is, but maybe it's Roger. But he looks like a cool lad. Excuse me, hiccup, stroke, burp, possibly, don't know. Um, go to Joe, go to Joe. Um, nice guy or girl, I'm not too sure. Is J-O-E um, the girl 
version of Joe or the male version? I don't know. I'm a bit confused about that. I should know because I've got a few girlfriends. Friends that are girls called Joe. But I always get confused. Comment down below. Let us know. Um, yeah. Who else is there? Oh, Jade Hunt Rules has been messaging us again. Just wanted to say thank you. Keep in touch, Jade. Oh, that's very kind. She's been one of our sort of like first subscribers. She's cool. Um, how are we doing about battery time? Hang on. Well, it's not flashing up yet, so we should be okay. <gasps> Ten minutes have been blabbering on for. I'm going to have to cut this short or, or um, wrap it up pretty quickly. Um, so, yeah, those massive shout-outs. Please, guys, keep um, subscribing, and uh, it's you guys that keep us going. If we didn't have subscribers or people didn't bother messaging us, then we'd have no reason to come online and sort it out. And not again. <laughs> Silence. We'd have no reason to come on and make more videos and keep updating the channel as rapidly as we do. Oh, we are, by the way, if you're thinking the channel looks a bit boring, which I don't personally like it, I think it's a bit dull, um, we are looking at getting some pretty backgrounds around here to make it look a bit nicer. But, again, it's just time and effort, and I don't have much of it at the moment. So please give us a chance, and we'll make it look nice and pretty. If you've got any ideas, any shout-outs, or things you want said, or reviewed, or done, or anything like that, just send us a message video response, whatever, and we'll do our absolute utmost to get it done as soon as possible for you. And um, yeah, take a look at our favourites as well. We've got some great favourites down here. There's a cassette versus the bloody apprentice, 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 which I think is brilliant. And our favourites bit, Love and Trolls Boxy. I love that. I can't stop listening to it. I've actually put it in my favourites so I can listen to it as a song. I'm not even going to put it as an MP3. And this guy here, this is his Copper Cab Raps Out against Chateau Feet. It does say Boxy, but it's not on there because it's too long a title. Um, and those are three awesome videos. Please have a look at them on our channel. So I think this is pretty much the vlog. Sorry it's not been outdoors, guys, today. I've just been too busy. I doubt you wanted to come walkies round Sainsbury's with me. Um, so, um, yeah, basically I'm going to wrap this uh, vlog up now and say thank you once again. Keep subscribing, keep commenting, send us messages, whatever you want, love. And um, any ideas or things you want to do, we have got some great ideas coming up. Some of them which you're going to love. Some of them we're saving though till we get a few more viewers cause, or subscribers because we're going to need a lot more subscribers for some of the uh, future um, ideas. Um, otherwise it just won't be worth it. But, yeah, please guys speak to you soon keep keep commenting keep vlogging keep texting whatever um messaging us and we'll get back to you enjoy your day and if i well i will get to speak to you beforehand but have a merry christmas and i hope all your christmas shopping goes well take care now bye bye click